actually, in, in Shilpa Shastra, it's described, this is how he killed him. He was standing. He was standing in the doorway because he, he had this benediction. He couldn't be killed inside or outside. So he was neither in the palace or out. He was in the threshold of the, pa the palace. So he, he, was, he wasn't sitting on the, on the threshold. He was standing with his leg like this. So in Supa Shastra, this is one form of the thing that they described. We have that deity. I have that deity. It's like this. Came a general. He became such a ruthless person. He destroyed all the temples, collecting each and every temple and destroyed. And that is why, if you see the deity is a temple, right from down till top, you see either the nose is broken, the hands are broken, everything. So he even broke this. And then one day, what happened in the river? He appeared. ये कितना साल पहले निकला यहाँ पे? Pani se. Yeah. Ten years. Ten years back, there, this DD reappeared. So the villagers got him and they installed him over here. So me and Kartamashi, we came in the morning and we asked the villagers whether you can give us this DD and we'll install him in Vrindavan. <laughs> so they said that the government has come and put it. And in due course of time, they are thinking of building something over here, small, something like that. So that's the history of this DD. But it's a very nice Pukaran Asana, very, very nice. We hit on a Kashiku over there. Very fine DD. And his intestines are going all the way All over, yeah. I'll explain something. Yeah.